Lazar Andrić and Lazar Babić are studying medicine in Serbia. If the state reintroduces compulsory military service, they will be called up as soon as they graduate. I think that it is useful. Things like discipline, waking up early, respecting authority, physical activity. It can be useful in your life. On the other hand, I am aware that if war comes, I have to be there, and I would wear my uniform with pride. I wouldn't go to the army. I don't see any benefit to our society. I also don't think it would be beneficial to the state. There are no war threats here, and even if there was, most of the countries that surround us are NATO members. Students like these two had the same dilemma until 2011. Compulsory military service was suspended then, due to the deteriorating image of the army and the lack of interest by those who were military fit. Half of them choose civil service, and 13 years later, Serbia has found itself with a shortfall in soldiers. Very often you hear that we are a regional powerful force in terms of tanks. It's true, but the question is how many crew members do you have for those tanks? That's the point. If you cannot replace personnel, you will be in a problem. But that's just one of the reasons for introducing service. The bigger one is the simmering tensions with Kosovo and other regional nations. Any military call-up could see the situation boil over, however, and leave Serbia in a conflict it may not be able to sustain. The reality is that K4 NATO actually is on the Kosovo territory, so conflict with Kosovo armed forces is conflict with NATO. Does Serbia have that kind of luxury to fight NATO again? I think no. When we defended Serbia, we ended up villages burned down and refugees fleeing. I think we will lose much more now. This graffiti behind me says that troops will return to Kosovo. Similar messages are all over the country. Even though it doesn't seem likely that there will be a new war or that Serbia could win one, society here is becoming more militarized. And the push to bring back mandatory military service is just more proof. Marko Vlahović, TRT World, Belgrade.